recognise that bloody footprint. How inviting! Thank you. Is that dude again? Is that fruit wall? For my way another dodgy picture. Shoot it off. I see if it'd do that. Then again, it's pretty thick. Moondar notes. Reddish leaves swirl in the wind like lost souls in search of rest. Like an open sketchbook focused on my dreams, this land is forever pictured as a comforting autumn dusk. Replete with a golden sky, with crackling river water and bubbling marshes that dot the land, it feels like a romantic artist's canvas. Upon further investigations, I have sensed horrendous visions of a gnarled doom decorated as a picturesque facade. Facade? Facade? Fa facade. See, I knew it wasn't right, that's why I kept saying it another time, I knew it wasn't right. Facade. In this endless autumn dusk. Spiny trees root deep into the foul earth, licking the ground dry of all that is good. Carcasses populate the brush, their putrid remains swallowed whole by the land, and corners of this malevolent area are teeming with vicious ungodly prey. All whilst the grass stretches a grass stretches across this land, twisting together like veins of pulsating sinew. As if the ground were alive, keen on the hab inhabitants of that parade on its back. Beardy black soulless eyes flash across the air. Tiny quick winged beasts streak through the bright sky. Flying razors waiting for the perfect moment to descend. As they swoop by, I see sharp bloody teeth and a nicked demonic smile. From the darting blurs, I hear an ominous whistling that chills my soul. They own the skies here. Riff like hooded minions, overseers without heart or soul patrol this land. Slash and stitch techniques permeate their faces and arms patched together like cheap quilts using the skin from the bodies of rank corpses. They gather and live like packs of rabid wolves, investigating fights for supremacy. Instigating fights for supremacy, sorry. These abominations first for my destruction. They are mostly clustered around footpaths that seem to traverse upward along the cliffside, but alternate groupings are planted among watering holes and the hollow trees. Further down the path, it is as if the shadows are swallowing the surroundings whole, without a perchant of logic or a drop of meaning. It is as if the only reason for this actually lies in the darkness itself. Like royalty that rules the black void, entombed in the night, infinite. It is she, the eternal mistress of shadows, Aaron. Very nice. As soon as I saw a first bit of like journal, as soon as it says like read your journal to begin with, I thought, you know what? I get this feeling this is actually going to be a pretty text heavy game, and there's no way I can skip it really. It kind of it won't be doing the game justice if I skipped over it, considering it's got such a good. It's obviously got good writing to it. No, you don't, buddy. What it, please? Yeah, it's got really nice writing, so I ain't gonna. <laughs> He's got that master, doesn't he? Scry, I already did it once. Well, actually, I did it about what two or three times, but even still, it's quite nice, though. East wing. A rodding. Let's go right. Fuck off armor. 
Yeah, whatever, I don't trust you. Door. Yeah, it opened. Oh, I like fucking paint it in there. What are you doing over there? Bethany often used this room as her office after Jeremiah left for the war. Oh, thanks for that. That was a very detailed description you just gave me there. Look around. Evil baby! Oh, kid, whichever. <laughs> Another journal entry. Shred it in front of evil baby. My god, there's a lot of text. It's like I said, it doesn't surprise me, really. And it's nice, anyway. Why do I waste my time with these posers and fools? I realise now that my correspondence with these others have been a waste of my time. If I've read them. What? If I've done more research than I could truly appreciate until now. Most of these other magicians are braggarts. What little braggarts? I guess braggarts are braggarts. Braggarts, I'm going to remember that one, it's a good one. Braggarts. Who act the part but rarely brave. Oh no. See, the font's hard to read. It's like that handwriting font, it's hard to fucking read. I have an inkling of the truth. I've tried to contact the Golden Dawn, but I've been ignored and insulted since I am not from the continent. Alistair Crowley insists I become his acolyte. I suspect it is more of a harem. What? A harem? Huh? His vanity is boorish and fraudulent. He's as confused as my brother. Both are lost in vices. While Aaron numbs himself and seeks escape, the great beast actually believes it to be a revelation. A few have been unresponsive or cryptic. I suspect that if I pursued them I might glean some knowledge. However, I am beginning to realise that my research and documentation are beginning to plateau. What I have learned must be put into practice. Perhaps the nature of knowledge that I seek cannot be found within the society. Trial and errors slowed my learning due to the long recovery periods. This, um, what well, Bethany? Another one, it must be one of her siblings or whatever. The help. Yeah, the help probably suspects something is amiss since my health fluctuates drastically from these rituals. Do not dare say anything. Besides, I can always blame the erratic fortitude upon my family legacy. That should be enough to excuse my bouts of weakness. Besides, Aaron languishes in a stupor even now. Bethany. What are you doing over there? Yeah, I saw you doing whatever you were doing. You were rolling something there. I saw you do it. Evil kid. What? Say something. Fuck off, then. Door. Him again. Oh, that's fucking lame. Oh, reload, that's even lamer. No, what? You fucking swing arc, man. No, I'm trapped. Assholes. Um, what is it? It's like health. Ooh. Does that going to take me all the way to full? Ah, try another one. That's alright though. Keep going? Yeah, I can't complain about I don't trust these fucking armors at all. Zoom. Hit him then. Holy shit! Retreat! No, no! Oh, she's fucking dead. And here for the escort. Fucking hell. No. Oh, you just caught me, you son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. There are fucking loads of them then. Okay, they caught me. Huh? Jammed. Jammed? Well, I should be having my screen shit out real. Right. Scry detector. Oh, she's dead. You didn't really need an update from me then, I'll tell you that, but I just thought I'd let you know. Okay. Loading! Ah, I see, it's that shit. If it's a dark room you're going into, it's roading. Oh, roading. Right. Ah, oh, fuck off, man. It seems like maybe it's because of that circle fucking crosser. It feels like you, you know, it's like you're kind of fighter, but it's fucking not. 
It's like fucking pin. What? Another one already, man. It's 